नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम्स यू इन इट्स डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम ऑफ ट्वेंटी सेवन ऑगस्ट सो लेट एस रिव्यू द यस्टर डे इज रियलाइज वेदर सो यू विल सी दैट द रेनफॉल कंसनट्रेटेड मेनली ओवर नॉर्थ ईस्ट इंडिया एंड एट जॉनिंग ईस्ट इंडिया इंक्लूडिंग बिहार रीजन सो एक्सट्रीमली हैवी रेनफॉल ऑफ द ऑर्डर ऑफ थर्टी एट सेंटीमीटर रिकॉर्डेड ओवर मेघालय रीजन एंड वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल ऑल्सो रिकॉर्डेड ओवर आसाम आसाम रीजन and very heavy rainfall also recorded over arunachal pradesh of the order of 15 cm and uh, very heavy rainfall of the order of 16 cm recorded over bihar region otherwise heavy rainfall recorded over sub himalayan west bengal sikkim nagaland manipur mizoram tripura and one or two stations in tamil nadu so these are the some important realized rainfall accordingly hi- highlights of today's briefing is that heavy to very heavy rainfall is likely to continue टुडे एंड टुमारो ओवर आसाम मेघालय एंड अरुणाचल प्रदेश सो दीज आर द फर्स्ट हाईलाइट्स एंड सेकेंड इज द सब्ड्यूड मानसून रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी लाइक टू कंटिन्यू ओवर रिमेनिंग पार्ट्स ऑफ द कंट्री ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट फोर फाइव डेज सो दीज आर दिनाप्टिक सिस्टम्स प्रिवेलिंग टूडे यू विल सी दैट वेस्टर्न एंड ऑफ मानसून ट्रफ रन अलॉन्ग द फोटेल्स ऑफ द हिमालयाज एंड ईस्टर्न एंड टूडे रन फ्रॉम गोरखपुर एंड देन दरभंगा and uh, balur ghat in submalan west bengal and then goes to manipur region and there is a cyclonic circulation in low troposphere levels over uh, western parts of assam another cyclonic circulation could be seen at 1.5 km intervals level over uh, tamil nadu coast north tamil nadu coast and a trough in low troposphere levels runs from south central karnataka to common area across western parts of tamil nadu and today western disturbance uh, uh, roughly 70 degree east and uh, 30 degree north is seen in middle troposphere level so these are the synoptic systems accordingly you will see that significant uh, cloud mass is uh, seen over northeast india and isolated patches over north tamil nadu and adjoining areas of coastal andhra pradesh now under the influence of these synoptic systems you will see that day one warning is as follows you will see that uh, orange color is given to Arunachal Pradesh and Assam and Meghalaya because isolated extremely heavy rainfall likely to uh, continue over Assam and Meghalaya region and very heavy rainfall likely to continue over Arunachal Pradesh today and heavy rainfall is expected over sub Himalayan West Bengal and Sikkim and uh, Manipur Tripura region and isolated heavy rainfall also likely over northern parts of Tamil Nadu and uh, some possibility of heavy rainfall also likely over uh, Konkan and Goa region otherwise you will see that over most parts of the country no significant weather warning has been issued only green color is given here so over these regions where green color is given only a uh, light rain is expected and uh, in some regions like western parts of rajasthan saurashtra kutch we are dry weather likely to prevail today now we will see the detailed uh, the warnings for meghalaya Assam and Arunachal Pradesh for today you will see that for today this map is for Meghalaya the southern parts of uh, Meghalaya is especially east kashi hills including sora amazon ram region uh, extremely heavy rainfall is expected otherwise very heavy to extremely heavy rainfall at one or two stations likely to receive today over southern parts of uh, Meghalaya and western parts of uh, this Meghalaya region as shown here so this west garo hills and uh, south west garo hills and uh, east kashi hills these stations these districts like to receive very heavy to extremely heavy rainfall today and this map is for arunachal pradesh you will see that the pockets shown uh, by orange color uh, likely to receive very heavy rainfall and yellow uh, colored patches likely to uh, receive uh, isolated heavy rainfall and green color uh, district shown by green color likely to experience light like to moderate rainfall today and this map is for assam region you will see that these two districts of south south assam and these districts of west assam likely to receive uh, uh, very heavy rainfall and uh, otherwise uh, districts uh, shown by yellow color like kokrajhar dhubriya etc yeah likely to experience heavy rainfall so the zone of uh, heavy rainfall is uh, western parts of uh, this uh, assam region then extreme north parts of the assam and this uh, extreme south parts of assam likely to experience some activity of heavy rainfall otherwise districts shown by green color like to experience light to moderate rainfall so these are the district warning map for arunachal pradesh assam and meghalaya 
now from day two onwards these map are shown here from day two you will see that this activity of uh, heavy rainfall very heavy rainfall likely to continue over assam meghalaya and heavy rainfall likely over uh, arunachal pradesh and uh, nagaland manipur mizoram tripura and some possibility of heavy rainfall also likely over andaman and nicobar islands on day two that is uh, 28th of august this map is valid for day 3 that is valid for 29th of august you will see that the activity of rainfall mainly concentrated over northeast india including arunachal pradesh assam meghalaya nagaland manipur mizoram tripura and andaman nicobar islands otherwise over most parts of the country weather likely to be remain uh, concentrated to only light rainfall and uh, some pockets of rajasthan gujarat etc likely to experience dry weather even this jammu kashmir region also likely to experience dry weather and for for this map is valid for day 4 you will see that only north east india including arunachal pradesh assam meghalaya and nagaland manipur mizoram tripura likely to experience heavy rainfall otherwise most parts of the country there is no significant weather warning has been issued similar condition likely to continue on day 5 so in that cell we can say that subdued rainfall activity likely to continue over remaining parts of the country excluding north east india so these according to these maps uh, is are valid for uh, such conditions now if we uh, we will discuss in uh, very brief about the impact so is impact received only for uh, today uh, due to very heavy rainfall over arunachal pradesh and assam meghalaya uh, because of uh, the possibility of this such activity otherwise there is no significant weather impact of heavy rainfall over any parts of the country as on day to day basis we are discussing so this is all about uh, uh, today's discussion you can uh, stay connected with the central water commission website for uh, Uh, this uh, flood uh, conditions over different parts of the country and uh, if any specific traffic advisory or any other uh, government uh, uh, functionaries or disaster managers issued any warnings kindly follow accordingly and uh, on day to day basis we also suggest some suggestions like i already mentioned here so this is all about today's briefing we will uh, assemble tomorrow in morning for a bit information till then namaskar jai hind jai bharat